Hello, hello, my beautiful people, and welcome to my channel. Hi, I am Advo, and in this video, I will show you a new way to complete airdrop blue flare. It is going to be super easy, I promise, and on the budget, just the way we like it. So let's go. So as for weapons, you will be using, well, I used the basic nail gun, um, sword, one star, two star, whatever you have, and one of the newest shotguns. No stars on it, can be the basic one. Honestly, you will be coming back to your home location with most of them anyway intact. Um, do bring some bandages, you know, for those wounds, and a bit of water, because we do get a bit thirsty, and do bring a bit of smoked meat or something along those lines to restore your HP. Now, regards to <laughs> to threats or fences, you don't need any threats. All you need is your basic fences. Place them exactly the way I've just placed them. You do not need one star, two star. Your basic fences will do just fine. You don't need Tourette's. You don't need Jane. You can do this on your own. So let's go. Okay, so let's pop on to the left side. Give those Georgies a bit of a swish. Um, now you will see most of your zombies coming from the right hand side. So the fence you have placed on the right hand side that's where the most action is going to happen honestly the middle one is going to be doing not much at all all those zombies will be crawling on your right hand side so just keep on swishing and swaying and just killing them do check in on your left hand side now and then give them a bit of a swish oh don't you just love the phrase effect of this word do you know what? Fun fact. You can find these swords. I don't think I have crafted one sword of my own. Nope, I don't think I have. I have been looting them in the parking lot. Every time you visit the parking lot, if you don't find a sword, I, I don't even know. You must find at least two, three swords at a time uh, when you visit the parking lot. And then if you do, <laughs> if you do go see the Joker, Jesus, you will find even more there. But... Basically, what I'm trying to say here is the sword, you don't even have to craft it if you do visit the parking lot, which I will actually link or pop it on the screen there. Um, I done a video there yesterday um, regarding the parking lot, so you can just pop on there and say how easy it is just to go in there, grab the loot and get out. All you need is five minutes and you will be coming home with some really nice weapons, um, including the swords. So, now on the left hand side, I can see that I was not struggling a bit, but I thought, okay, let's bring out the shotgun there, give them a bit of a kick. But as you can see, what I've used a bit of water, healed myself once or twice. You really need the most basic items just to finish the blue flare. Um, it is completely, it's so cheap, it's so affordable, and I think it honestly is probably the best one to complete regards to budget. <laughs> if you are a budget kind of person, that is the best flare for you to complete. Now, uh, I see that my zombies there escaped there for a bit, but not to worry. We got their bombs kicked as we should. And here we go. Let's get that blossom. One last a swish, a swish. Oh, he tried to get me there. No, but you didn't. Um, we're just coming to the end there. The air. There we go. Where is my loot? Oh, dropped on my head thank you but as you can see for the loot oh, very decent very good if you think about the weapons I brought with me and the fact I only used 63 I think it was just about 63 caps to buy them three fences and you get all of this in return I think it is a bargain if you ask me but 
Anyway, thank you for being here. I hope this video helped you. If it didn't, I'm sorry. But if it did, well, like and subscribe.